Did you know Teen Wolf was going to be that big of a hit? Uh, well, so I jumped on the third season. Oh, so it was already hit. So it already was a uh, a giant hit. My my, my story is kind of crazy though. I knew about Teen Wolf before it ever started because I worked with um one of the directors who's also a producer on the show on Prayers for Bobby. He directed Prayers for Bobby uh-huh. Russell. Um, and so I auditioned for season one of Teen Wolf. Um, and then I auditioned for season two where um for a different role where I was it. it it was between me and, and another kid or a couple kids. But I mean, I auditioned for that one like 17 times. I had Teen Wolf 17 me, times. Like, a ton in front of, for just for MTV. And MTV wasn't behind me. And they had an offer out to Daniel Sharman, um, who had just come off like a really popular movie at the time, The Immortals, I think. Um, and I didn't know that. So they just like, it felt like, they kept giving me different notes. Like they're like, oh, he's too edgy. He needs to be more GQ or he's got to be more nerd. So like I'd go in these auditions like, dressed completely different every time and they'd be like <laughs> and it was just smoke and mirrors to tr- they're waiting for daniel to answer them and mtv right. didn't like me um so yeah the third the third season is when i actually got on did they offer it to you or you have to audition no, again hey there folks it's michael rosenbaum and boy have i got a huge announcement for you this has been a long time coming and it's finally here i'm doing a live podcast my podcast inside of you with michael rosenbaum is going live Yeah, for the first time ever on Wednesday, October 11th at the iconic Regent in Los Angeles. And guess what? I'm not going to be alone. Um, We're bringing a guest you might remember. He's been on the podcast. He's a friend of the show. The one, the only, Zachary Levi. We're going to catch up on life and mental health. And we're going to have a really good time with all of you. I think you know that. We're going to make it a lot of fun. We're planning a QA. and a maybe some fun games, other exclusive stuff you're only going to get by seeing it live. We're even hosting a VIP meet and greet for a small number of people before the show begins. Grab your tickets, mark your calendars, and get ready for the night of laughs, insights, and unforgettable moments. Tickets are limited, so don't miss your chance to join us on October 11th at The Regent in Los Angeles. Get your tickets now at insideofyoulive.com. This is going to be an epic night, so if you're in the area, come out and I'll see you there. Uh, that one was uh, no, I, I auditioned, but it was I was heavily favored. Really? Yeah. Finally, this guy's paid his dues. Yes. Let's like I, I always well. had people on Team Wolf behind me, Jeff now, and and Russell for sure. That's good. You have to I have got, yeah. <clears throat> you have to have cheerleaders. You yeah. have to have somebody out there that's yes. rooting for you, and that's so important in life. It's like having somebody that believes in you. Yeah. Because no, I owe them a lot. It's hard to believe in yourself sometimes when nobody else does. So if you have that one person, I always talk about that. You know, my, you know, I had a, a teacher that actually was patient with me. I remember Mr. Morrow, Mr. Morrow. In fact, I went back home in Indiana and uh, I said, hey, we're all going to Taroni's for some pizza. I'm taking everybody to pizza. <clears throat> Why don't you come? He goes, I'd love that. I would love to do that. <laughs> so old Mr. Morrow straight up and all my friends were like, what? Who's this dude? <laughs> I go, this is Mr. Morrow. And I, I don't really remember Mr. Morrow. <laughs> Some did, but like most, yeah, yeah, yeah. he was like, he was a substitute teacher. Thank God for this in this one year. And, and uh, we, we hit it off. He was just, he was just cool, but he, you know, he was, yeah. he, he didn't treat me like I was like stupid. Yeah, exactly. And it, it means the world when you're a kid, you know, like just someone to, that you connect with or that, you know, doesn't treat you like a child. Yeah. It means a lot when you're a kid. So you get the role and I know MTV. And a lot of these streamers, I, I, I assume Tubi is probably pretty cheap. Um, but MTV money, I remember I did a show and I mean, <laughs> uh, guys, I'm telling you, <clears throat> I got this pilot for MTV with Jackson Brown's son, Ethan, great guy, and Leslie Bibb. And the three of us did this show and I was paid $4,000 for the pilot. Sounds about right. And after taxes and everything was about for three, Agents four manager, weeks work. Yeah, oh, yeah. And I, I, I think I had $1,400. Yeah. And then, yeah. So I know. And, and then they wanted me to do a development deal because uh, the, the pilot didn't go, but they liked me. We'll give you five grand. I'm like, whoa. Yeah, I'm rich. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> but I mean, were you like, was it? Was same, it same story. MTV is not, they're not known for paying well. Um, but did they start to pay you in season four and season five? I mean, or, or was it just never a thing about money with that show? They no, they were. It was tough. Always battle. Even the actors that were there from the beginning were <laughs> battling. And MTV is just not. So the cool thing, though, with MTV that we got lucky with is um, like the CW, for instance, uh, conventions, you know, like the oh, fans are so strong and so powerful that doing these conventions pays good money. Um, 
And so that's with, where the money comes with, to get that keeps on giving. Yeah, with Teen Wolf, we could do conventions with Teen Wolf named whatever. Like we could they uh, like the Arrow ones or like ones for CW. It's always like bow and arrow or like something that's not nothing to do with Teen Wolf, but it's like similar, you know. Right. Whereas for, for whatever MTV didn't have any of those restrictions on us, so you know we we did well in conventions if we were able to get away from work. 